Hello students, this is Ashwin, your super teacher at 7 classes and we were discussing surface area and volume. As you know, we have covered many three dimension figures and the one of the most important figures from your CBSE exam point of view, that is a cone. So, Today, we will be discussing cone, we will see how to calculate the volume of a cone, how to calculate the lateral surface area of a cone, how to calculate the curve surface area and total surface area, all that, okay, using a trick formula. So, there are some dimensions which you need to be aware of. The very first thing which you can see over here, that is this red dotted line, okay. This particular point of a cone is known as the apex, apex of the cone. From the apex of a cone, if we drop a perpendicular, it will exactly intersect at the base. That is a circle and it will exactly intersect at the center of the circle. This particular height is known as the height of the cone. Okay. Now basically in cone, there are two types of height. One is the height and one is the lateral height. Okay. That is L. So this particular height is known as lateral height as you can see over here the distance from this to this particular point is known as the radius so as i have told you there are three dimensions which are involved over here the very first is the height the second is the lateral height and the third is the radius of the cone okay now let's derive the formulas involving cone the very first formula which we will be seeing is a volume, okay? Now, as you know, I have given you shortcuts to calculate volume of different 3D structures. Similarly, I am going to give you a small trick formula or master formula which will help you in deriving the volume of a cone. And the trick formula is 1 by 3 into base area into height okay let's try to understand this in detail as you know this 1 by 3 will be constant now base area everybody knows what is the base of a cone the base of a cone is nothing but a circle and area of a circle is what yes exactly pi r square into height now over here be careful we are talking about the actual height of the cone and not the lateral height or slant height okay so just talking about the height so that is going to be h so from here i'll get what 1 by 3 pi r square h that's it so that's your volume of a cone let's talk about csa that is the curved surface area or it is also known as the lateral surface area. Now, over here also, I have a trick formula for you, uh, which I'll be showing you. So basically, the trick formula over here is half into base perimeter, base perimeter into lateral height, lateral height now students often do this mistake over here instead of taking the lateral height they take the actual height again i'm repeating this is the height of the cone and this is the slant height of the cone okay so let's plug in the formula and see what we are getting half again base perimeter what is the base of a cone the base of a cone is a circle and everybody knows what is the perimeter of a circle that is the circumference itself and what is the circumference over here 2 pi r into now what is the lateral height or the slant height l so into l as you can see over here this 2 and this 2 is getting cancelled so what are you left with you're left with pi r l that's it so that is the csa or the lsa of a cone now let's come to the very final part that is the tsa see what happens no when you're talking about the lateral surface area you neglect the base over here now in order to calculate the tsa what you need to do 
we'll use the master formula that is CSA plus base area. Okay, base area. Now we have already calculated the CSA. What is the CSA? The CSA is nothing but pi r l plus again as you can see over here what is the base made up of the base is made up of a circle so over here the base area will be what area of a circle which is nothing but pi r square so as you can see over here the formula which we will be getting over here is uh, so you can see you can take pi common so that will be pi and you can take one r also common so pi r and you're left with l plus r okay so over here we have discussed what exactly is a cone what are the dimensions of the cone and we have discussed the volume the csa and the tsa okay so this was our discussion related to cone stay tuned for more videos